Hey everyone, I wanted to introduce you guys to this awesome brush I just made in ZBrush and I'm giving it away for free to all my YouTube subscribers. Now, I just want to demonstrate exactly what this brush does and why it's so powerful. So have you ever been in one of these situations where you've got a model made and let's say maybe you've got a client or an art director and they say, looks great, but I just wish the detail were amped up a bit more. And so then you just go back to work and you're like, oh man, I just got to go back in and just start like sculpting all this detail in back a little bit more. It's going to take all day to just, you know, amp up this detail. Well, no more. This is going to be so awesome. You guys check this out. So what you do is you download the brush. I've got the link in the description and you install it as a macro. What you're going to download from the descriptions is this ampdetail.zip. You're going to unzip these files into the uh, ZBrush, Z Startup, Macros, MISC folder. And in there, you're going to get your amp detail, amp detail text, and amp detail.z script. Then you're going to restart ZBrush. And what you're going to do is come up into your macros, open up the macros going to click on amp detail. And what it's going to do is going to calculate what this extra detail should look like first. Then it's going to switch to the morph brush and literally all you do is just brush on the extra detail. And it just appears like magic. Isn't that cool? It's just amping up the detail. It could not be simpler. Now you can control this a little bit more in the morph target palette here. And what you can do is actually just crank up the detail everywhere with morph. Or actually very interesting what you can do is go the opposite direction. Now I've already painted on extra detail in some areas, but if I hadn't painted anything on, so let me actually go back and set that to zero. I'm gonna hit control Z to undo that extra detail that I put on there. Let's run this morph backwards. You can see it actually, you can also go backwards and just remove all the detail. So you can just dial this in exactly where you want this extra detail to be. So I hope you enjoy this new brush and share a link in the comments to anything you do with it. All right, thanks for watching and I hope to see you next time.